kidding me? No. I broke Gene Simmons. Are you kidding me? I was gonna, I had this idea for this lesson. I was gonna hook Gene up to the strings on my guitar. I actually had him hooked up. His hands, actually I can still get half his body on here. This is what I was doing. Check it. Because he's got his fingers exposed here, you know? So I had him like this. Like that. I thought, oh, it'd be cool. I'm doing a kiss lesson, right? Plaster caster for Dan Johnson. Put the Gene Simmons doll on the guitar. And just as I was leaning in to hit record, Gene fell. And he's in two pieces now. So I got his legs, you know, the lower torso, but it literally broke. I thought when it first broke, oh, no biggie. It's like a Barbie doll when you rip the head off of a Barbie got that knobby thing and you can pop it back into place I'll just pop Gene back into place nope it ain't happening man the demon's been destroyed jeez well I can super glue it but you know his hips still move kinda oh yeah plaster anyways what do you do you know what do you do this goes out to Dan Johnson, my subscriber and my student on Skype, a request for KISS, plaster caster. Uh, KISS, man, what, what can I say? I mean, except when I was five years old, I liked KISS. I had the KISS lunch pail, the KISS cards, all that good stuff. And uh, before, way before I thought about playing guitar. Actually, that's what got me thinking about playing guitar was Ace Freely, you know. I thought, man, this dude is so fast. The, his Les Paul is smoking. There's smoke coming out of it. I did think that, by the way. But KISS, you know, they kind of started it all for me. And, um, you know, just a big Ace Freely fanatic. And um, so, it's going to be fun for me to do this. You want to tune flat for this song? Um, there's lots of versions all over the internet, you know, when they had Bruce Kulik and, you know, the different drummers and, you know, the new guy they got that got that was Ace's roadie that he plays guitar for him. Um, the unplugged on MTV. I went to the studio version because the other ones were in standard. I went to the studio, I checked a couple of them. They were both flat. So Kiss tuned flat when they recorded this on the Love Gun album in 1977. Is that right, Gene? Am I right? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Because I'm the king of the nighttime world. Okay, so here we go. Ready? <laughs> Go ahead, have your lower toes, torso knock my guitar out of tune. Thanks, Gene. Man, I must have pissed him off. His lower torso was down there, that's where he's gonna stay. Close enough for rock and roll. And back to... No, that's right.
You guys ready? Let's do it. Kiss Plaster Caster. Everything I just played, you're gonna learn. Man, Gene really knocked my guitar out of tune. Man, it's all right, I broke him in half. So, who got the worst end of that deal, huh? Gene or me? I could tune my guitar again. Gene's actually split. All right, so, start with this. Open A, 2D, 2G. Don't do the that version, do it like this. Just bar it, hit A, D, G. And then I'm uh, going to what's called D suspended into D major. Basically 2E, 3B, 2G, and your pinky add it to 3E. Yes, we have two fingers on the same string. There's a reason for that. You're gonna hit the E and B and do a pull off with your pinky to that second fret. And then hit the G and B, two, three. And then you're gonna do that twice. And then you go right back. That's all it is on the intro. Go up to a 8A, 10, 10, 10, D, G, B. Hit those four, it's a whole note, gets four counts. Two, three, four. And then move that up to 10, 12, 12, 12. Okay, so. And then a 5, 7, 7, 7, A, D, G, B. Uh, so this is gonna be You'll hit, it's a, a D chord here, right? You're going to go to a suspended. To turn this into a suspended, you're going to take your pinky and go to fret 8 on the B string. So basically, you're doing 5, 7, 7, 8. Keep the bar because we're going to resolve that suspended back to the major. Two, two hits here. Lift your pinky off. So you'll go. And then slide it. And then go down, up, down on the A chord. You're starting it over, the song at that point. Alright, so, um, from here. start breaking that down. It's a bass walk up to um, a G chord. Go open E, second fret E, and third fret E. Then we're going to strum the G major chord. Three, two, open, open, three, three. And then two A, three A, open D. And then strum a D major chord. Two, three, two, open from the bottom up. And then repeat that, so you have. Then we go like this. Which Kiss used a lot. Bar the 10th fret on the D, G, and B. Strum them twice. Then go 12D and 11B. Keep the bar there, so obviously we're gonna have a 10 off that twice and then lift it back up to the bar. So twice, twice, once. And then 10A, 12, 12, 12, DGB. So we have. If you listen close, you'll hear that little walk up. It doesn't mean Ace and Paul were both doing it. It was probably Ace. Um, so you have 3-5-E-A, 4-6-E-A, and 5-7-E-A. And then this old blues riff. Hit the E where it sits. Pinky, 9-A. Back to the 5-E, 7-A. And that's going to repeat. 5-E, 9-A. 5-7. 5-9. 7 So...
Okay. Then we'll go. Eight, ten, ten, E, A, D. We're going to move chromatically, which means a half step at a time, which means one fret at a time. So eight, ten, nine, eleven, ten, twelve. Then 10A, 12, 12, 12, DGB, right? So we have. I don't know if they do the walk up the second time, but. Back, and then go 8, 10, 10, 10, A through G. And then 8, 10, 10, E, A, D. So you'll have. Dang it. Oh, then you'll go. You'll go to this G chord, three, five, five, four. You'll go to a C, three A, five, 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 D, G, B. Three times, you're gonna accent it. In other words, don't go. Want to rest, just take the, your side of your palm here, so you'll go. Right? Instead of, it'll be. Alright. So anyways, that's it for this lesson. I'm really sad about Gene. I'll do my best to fix him. Get him put back together. His, his life's kind of shattered right now, you know. My email, mike at rockingguitarlessons.com. My website, rockingguitarlessons.com. My Skype name is rockingguitarlessons.com. If you would like private lessons on Skype, I do teach around the world guitar and bass. I've been teaching full-time since about 1991. Full-time on Skype for the past two, three years. This is all I do. I had to quit the stores. And, uh, but I love it. I wouldn't exchange it for anything in the world. I like teaching around the world. It's fun. It's cool. Um, anyways, on my website, actually my wife Jolene teaches vocals too, if you're interested in that. But there's a tutorial from her and me on the website, rockingguitarists.com. The price breakdown is there on the website and uh, just more information, you know. Basically, you get a half hour or 60 minutes per week or bi-weekly and the payments are all the, the way it works. You pay for the month, you get a discount, blah -de blah or you can just pay per lesson. Um, CVT lessons, custom video tablature lessons. I gotta fix this strap. Everything's breaking today. Um, basically, you know, if you're too busy to do the one on one lessons on Skype, because some people are, man, they're just on the go, go, go. And, uh, and don't have the time to, you know, put the hour, you know, on a set day, set time each week. Let me know what it is that you want done. I handwrite the tabs, which is the kind of music and a map to memorizing, so to speak. Uh, subgroup, time, time stamp, everything. What's a scramp? And uh, scan the tab, send them to your email, and then I upload a video lesson, put it on the channel so you got the audio and the visual. They both go together, and they're very thorough and very detailed. You would let me know. Gene fell, the strap fell. Um, so anyways, um, I have a lot of CBT students, so if, that, if that's a route you want to go, email me, and uh, be sure to share these videos here. I really appreciate it. Subscribe. Uh, send me your requests of uh, songs you've always wanted to learn the right way and I'll teach you the right way to play them and uh, yeah spread it around through social media land there's his legs where'd he go Gene oh yeah I'm over here so Gene would like to say see you later until next time I'm Mike Gross Rockin' Guitar Lessons dot com. I'll play this on the outro for you. <coughs> Come on, hang around, Gene. Hang around. So show him the love. Alright, later on. He jinxes me, man, this tuning. Alright, later on guys. Still out.
go. 